Hey everyone, welcome to the wonderful world of bugs. Hope you enjoy your cicadas. I'd like to talk about ticks this month. Most important thing is to try to prevent the tick bites in the first place. So wear light colored clothing, tuck your pants into your socks. They're easier to find with light colored clothing. It's not that the light colored clothing repel repels them. Uh, you can spray eucalyptus oil, rosemary oil, geranium oil. They don't like any of that. They also tend to stay away from people that eat a lot of garlic but might so your friends might too uh nothing as effective as deet and i don't love to hear myself say that but if you spray it on your shoes and your clothes and not directly on your skin you may avoid that exposure to the pesticides if you find a tick on your body take a pair of tweezers and get as close to the skin as possible pull the tick straight up with steady pressure until the tick releases. Do not put nail polish, petroleum jelly, diesel, or kerosene on it because it, it could make the tick actually vomit the contents of its stomach into your body. So very gentle pressure and um, get that off with tweezers. If you find a tick that you think has been on there for more than 36 hours, please call your doctor because there is a prophylactic single dose treatment that may help prevent disease. There are two big ticks that I want you to look for in particular, the uh, Lone Star tick that has the white spot on its back and the Ixodes, which is the deer tick has black legs on it. Those tend to carry the greatest amount of disease. Remember, if it's been on there for more than 36 hours, if you've already got a rash from it, let your doctor know. I hope you guys have a safe and wonderful month of June.